Hey guys, Clumsy Silver Dad here. How's it going? How's everyone today? Uh, talking about silver, gold, bullion, uh, collectible coins, so forth. Um, I got a, just a couple out here. I'm going to be doing a lot of videos uh, going through some of my collection. I really got into it the past two months, I'd say. Uh, inside here is like my old uh, collection from being a kid, stuff from my grandparents. So there's not a ton of value in there. There's some, you know, Peace Dollars, Morgan Dollars. You can check it out if you want to on my Clumsy Dad YouTube channel. But how did I get back into this? Well, I've been kind of on the sidelines with investing the last couple of years, uh, thinking the market's overvalued and all that train of thought that a lot of people in the silver stacking community have. And uh, then, you know, watching alternative economic stuff, got into Chris Duane's stuff about, you know, some of his videos about, you know, anti-currency, anti-fed, stuff like that, with a bunch of other people. And anyways, I'll do a video about different investing or financial people I find interesting at some point. But yeah, so I got back in and seeing that the silver price seems more attractive these past couple of years now. So for me, between that and gold, is the only main way I'm seeing to make a return once the market crashes, which it just has to do if you look at the financial information. So what we got here, just a couple things. Um, just some of this first stuff I picked up. Um, I've ordered most stuff online recently, but this are a few things I picked up at local coin stores. This is, of course, um, the Buffalo. This is by Silvertown, I believe. Sorry guys, I'll work on my focusing in future videos. Um, maybe do some in natural light because I'm downstairs right now. This was another one I picked up, one of my first ones from Elemental, which is just a beautiful, cool little, uh, you got the AG silver symbol, and uh, it's really just a nifty little bar. And you'll see I'm starting to get into collecting different bars too. Um, and coins, you know, I got coins from all the major countries, of course, United States, Canada, China, um, Australia. Here's an Austrian. So we'll get more into that. These are some cute little pandas I picked up. This is one of my best values. These were selling just for $3 over spot, $20 at the time at the coin shop. So hopefully they're authentic. They look pretty spectacular. So I got a 6 and a 15 and I bought a 17 online. So I'm getting up into a decent amount of ounces. Now like I said, this is just kind of a little preview here for my first video. Here's a Philharmonic course. Came in a nice little case at the coin store. And then recently I was in there when spot was 15.5 and I picked up some uh, bullion for three dollars over spot so some stuff I didn't have like Ohio precious metal this is a nice little round pretty cool little back again guys I'll work on the work on the focus in the future then I got a Northwest Territory of metal and like I said I'm trying to pick up different ones like an idiot I didn't realize I'm looking at this thinking it's like Pan American Silver Corp but it's actually Northwest Territorial too but anyways, this one might be slightly rare because it was selling for quite a bit on eBay. So I guess it's a pretty good little pickup. So yeah, I just wanted to give you a quick intro. I'm going to getting into a lot more stuff, different topics, even gold. I got some questions about gold. Um, and uh, If you guys leave a link to your page, give me a like or whatever the hell you're supposed to do on Steemit. Uh, post your you know, link below your name. I'll check out your stuff. I'm looking for people to subscribe to and all that stuff. So, anyways, Clumsy Silver Dad here. Have a good one. Enjoy silver, gold, and all the precious metal stuff. We'll talk to you soon. Later.